and I really look forward to watch what both guys have in store for this one. Both men look ready to go. Touch of gloves and we're off. You know, Danny's the, Danny's the much longer fighter and he's looking right now to stay long and kind of keep Gio on the outside with that long jab of his. He's using really good footwork right now and able to utilize his reach advantage. You know, right now, I would say Danny's doing a good job trying to control the center. You know, Gio does a good job when he's able to press you up against the fence and get some big takedowns. We'll see what answer Gio has for the range of Danny, but Danny coming forward with a big flurry. Landing some big shots. Danny pressing forward, not getting greedy. He takes a step back. I like the patience. I like the patience he's showing. Man, both guys are being very patient in this fight, and I love to see it. But, but every time they connect, they're both trading some big shots. But Danny right now is doing a good job keeping all his shots coming right down the middle, making it hard for Gio to come in. Danny should be careful. It looks like Giovanni does have some power in his hands. You know, right now on the feet, I think the name of the game has been Danny's distance management. But Gio comes right over the top, as I say that, with a nice overhand. You know, Gio seems to be starting a little slow, but he's starting to pick up the pace a little bit. Danny looks like he wants to use his reach advantage, keep Giovanni at bay, but Giovanni wants to get inside and land that big hit. He's had some success with it. I can see he has power. Let's see if he's able to use it and change this fight around. I do believe Danny is controlling more at this moment. You know, I think right now Danny's doing a great job trying to stay in the center of the cage. Throwing some nice one two, switching up with his jab and his cross. There seems to be a little mouse forming on the side of uh, Giovanni's head. So definitely landing some big shots, Danny is. Landing big shots is Giovanni as well. Both of these guys, they both understand the assignment. They're here for a title fight and both of them want to win it. You know, I'm very surprised we have not seen a takedown come from Giovanni. We'll have to see if he's maybe saving it for later on in the fight. But right now, I think he's comfortable here trying to bang it out with Danny. But man, Danny just seems to be able to connect more just because of his range. Looping overhand by Danny that Giovanni was able to just to get out of the wave of. Man, watching this, you wouldn't even know it was MMA. This looked like a kickboxing round to me. Man, I think going into the second round is going to be in Giovanni's favor to really start mixing in the takedowns. That range seems to be giving him some issues. 